<clears throat> so in this uh, video I'll be doing an example for the method of sections. I'll be using the same example that I did um, in the method of joints, so you could have used that one. Or if you, the question is only find the, the forces in member DE, so this one, in DB, so this one, and AB, then this would be a quicker method of, of doing it, instead of finding them all and then working it out that way. So what we can literally do is we can, for the method of sections, we can make a section here and then split it up. So this would be the ideal section because we want DE, DB, and AB since they all go through um, this section, like we're cutting through all of them. So that effectively makes this structure. So I'm just going to write the forces as the the number of the name of the member so now we can do our global equilibrium kind of stuff that we did before uh, one meter. so for example let's do to find out DE, we want to do the moment about some point. Um, so we can do it about uh, this point B, which eliminates um, these uh, forces since they go through the point of uh, that we're doing the moment about. So let's do this. Anti-clockwise is positive. The sum of the moments about that's point B there um, equals zero. So therefore, we have DE is the positive. DE times 1, since it's 1 meter away from this, um, minus um, 20 times 1, since it's 1 meter away from here, equals 0. So then we get DE equals 20 kilonewtons. So that's the, the force in member DE. <coughs> um, also straight off we can do, without even using that, we could do some of the forces in the y direction equals 0, um, using up as positive. So then we get um, db sine 45 so this is taking the y component of db uh, and it's going up minus 20 equals 0 since uh, these don't act in the the y direction these two um, and it's only db and this 20 external force here so db equals 20 on sine 45 kilonewtons and then similarly we can now do the some of the forces in the x direction since we have um, the x component we can work out the x component of this db now so to the right is positive so some of the forces in the x direction equals zero therefore we get negative de minus ab minus um, cos oh sorry db cos 45 equals zero. That's because all the forces are acting to the left. So then what we don't have is A B. So A B equals negative D E plus D B cos forty five. Okay. So then therefore A B equals negative so the negative will indicate that it's 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 acting in the opposite direction as we got written here. So DE, so that's 20 plus um, cos 45 on sine 45 times 20 equals some number, and that's um, that's literally it. that's how that's how we do the the method of sections to find the <coughs> forces in each member. <coughs>